In the quaint village of Saranaka, nestled amongst rolling hills and sun-kissed mountains, lived three unlikely companions whose lives were changed forever by a magical pussycat with silver whiskers. Meet Astrid, the adventurous dreamer with a heart full of wonder. Felix, the pragmatic scholar with a thirst for knowledge. And Isabella, the mystical herbalist with a deep connection to nature. And of course, there was Paws, the extraordinary cat whose whiskers held the key to unlocking the secrets of Pronoia. Astrid was known far and wide for her insatiable curiosity and her infectious laughter. She could often be found exploring the meadows, chasing butterflies and dreaming of far off lands. Felix, on the other hand, spent his days with his nose buried in dusty tombs, seeking answers to life's mysteries. Isabella tended to her enchanting herb gardens finding solace in the whispers of the wind and the songs of the birds. Then one day, when Astrid was skipping deep into the depths of the forest, she stumbled upon a curious sight. It was a cat with shimmering silver whiskers nestled atop a moss-covered rock. The cat's eyes seemed to hold the wisdom of all the ages and its gaze held a mysterious invitation. Intrigued, Astrid approached cautiously. His greetings, fair traveler. The cat purred. Is uh, I am Paws, the guardian of the enchanted whiskers. What brings you to this magical realm? Astrid's eyes widened in awe. Magical realm? I did not know such a place existed. Paz chuckled. <laughs> yes, indeed. Zerenica is a realm of magic and wonderment. But to unlock its secrets, you first must embrace Pronoia. It is the essence of living in the moment and trusting in the universe's benevolence. Astrid tilted her head. Pronoia is at the opposite of paranoia. <laughs> yes, you do catch on quickly, don't you, child? Paws winked. Pronoia is the embodiment of trust and positivity. It is the bridge that allows thought to manifest in the physical plane. Embrace it, and you will witness wonders beyond your wildest dreams. From that day on, Astrid's heart was filled with the love of Pronoia. She shared her newfound wisdom with Felix and Isabella, and together they embarked on a journey of adventure discovery, guided by Paws' enigmatic presence. As they explored Serenica's hidden wonders, they encountered quirky characters and magical phenomena. One memorable encounter was with the mystical Gypsia, a fortune teller with a penchant for riddles. Seek the heart of enchanted whiskers, for there lies the secrets to unlocking the power of manifestation. Gypsy whispered cryptically. Confused, the trio ventured deeper into the woods, determined to unravel this crazy riddle. Their quest led them to the Tree of Whispers, an ancient oak shrouded in secrets. Beneath its towering branches, they found a hidden chamber, and within it, a journal inscribed with peculiar symbols. Felix, the scholar, deciphered the symbols with ease. Uh, let, let me see here. Oh, wow. Well, that's a tale of three friends who, uh, let's see here, embrace Pronoia uh, with the help of a creature with, hmm, whiskers, it says. And through him, they discover the essence of manifestation. <laughs> wow. Isabel's eyes gleamed. Perhaps this is the key to unlocking the enchanted whiskers power. Astrid nodded. Oh, let's read the tale and learn of its wisdom. 
as they opened up the book, it told of a story as old as time, but with three friends, a dreamer, a scholar, and an herbalist, all guided by a magical cat. And they all embarked on a quest to embrace pronoia and manifest their deepest desires. Through uh, laughter and logic, dreams and discoveries, uh, um, uh, we can unlock the power of living in the moment. Felix mused, Isabella's fingers trace the page. Uh, and, and look here. In the end, they all found the, the enchanted whiskers was not an external power, but a reflection of the magic that lives inside of all of us. Astrid's heart swelled with inspiration. Uh, let's embrace Pronoia and unlock the magic within ourselves. With newfound resolve, the trio ventured further, unraveling the secrets of Serenica's enchantment. Along the way, they encountered all sorts of crazy challenges and hardships. And one crazy encounter, Astrid stumbled upon a pond where her reflection seemed to whisper of her deepest desires. As she gazed back deep into her own eyes, she realized Pronoia resided within her own heart, waiting to be unleashed. Then Felix stumbled across an ancient library where its tomes whispered truths about the harmony of the universe. He understood that embracing Pronoia was not about controlling outcomes, but trusting in the journey 